Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I'm going to be showing you all the wax warmers that I would like to go and pan because I have so many in my collection and I just want to get rid of them because I have so much. Two drawers full is too much for wax warmers. So um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so you can go and see later on videos of everything that I completed. So. I know the scenery has changed a lot. I just wanted to go and not have to lug everything back to my beauty room since it's just too much. So I'll just go and jump right into it. So I am just want to start off with um, the, what the hell do you call it? With the incense, and that's in the scent of dragon's blood. I have not used them. There is 40 in them, completely unopened, completely untouched. So I wanted to go and use these up completely. I have a wax warmer, not wax warmer, I have a incense um, burner in my, in my beauty room, so I want to go and use that when I'm filming videos or just doing my makeup or something. Um, another thing I wanted to go and pan was my Ambi Essence Wax Warmer in Sea Breeze, and I have four left. Um, I, this is one of the oldest ones in my collection. Um, I will try to list everything down below. Um, today might be a, it may happen at a later date because right now I'm kind of busy because I'm going to be going out somewhere. So that's why everything's kind of, you know, different. So I also want to go and pan my Ambi Essence Cherry Blossom Wax Warmer. There is two left. And a lot of these are just... I've had them for so long, it's just like, okay, now it's time to use them, you know, stop waiting for the springtime to use them, just use them up and get more. So I also want to pan the Sensationals Mountain Twilight, and it's the, um, it's a cool breeze over pine and aspen. Now this is still a good, um, winter scent. It's very Christmassy smelling, and I have two left to use. And then I have the Sensationals Moon Garden, Moon Garden. This is a limited edition, and it's in blooming paper whites. Um, if you guys have subscribed to my channel long enough, then you guys know that in my favorites, Middle Roads and Flops, this was something I didn't like, and I don't want to throw it out because I did pay for it, so I am going to be using it up. I do have four left. And then I want to use the Glade Wax Melts, and it's in the scent of Blue Odyssey. And I have four left. These, um, I don't think they smell the way they do when you go and actually open it up. I really wanted to, it to smell like what it actually did, but it didn't. So I just want to get rid of them. Um, usually when I burn my wax warmers or melt them or whatever, I usually have one day good scent, two day I, I like add another, or I don't at all, or I just let, I, first day I put it in, I let it melt all day. Second day I let it melt, third day, by like midday, I usually just change it over, and I have this little handy dandy little cup that I only put all my wax, that way it's easier to get out, I do it when it's hot, so there's just that little tidbit. And then I want to use up the Better Homes and Gardens Limited Edition Apple Blossom Freesia. This is a really good scent. I really enjoy it, but like I said, I just need to get rid of it. There's three left. And then I have my um, Garden Better Homes and Gardens Limited Edition Fall and Autumn. This is like my favorite autumn scent. It's like the perfect spicy autumn -y, crispy, uh, it's just perfect, but I love it. I have one left, which is, this is really easy, but I have like two or three of them I got because this is my favorite scent for fall time. Um, I also have the Better Homes and Gardens Limited Edition Stormy Autumn Night. It looks like this, and I have three left. Um, I don't really burn candles. I do have four cats. So it's hard for me to place candles where they won't knock it over, get hurt, or just that kind of thing. My wax warmer, they don't really go near it. They don't bother it because it's on my counter. 
so it's easier for me to go through wax warmers than it is candles. Um, I do have a candle somewhere that I wanted to use up, but I think it's in my beauty room, so I'll probably have to go and get that midway through the video. So the next thing I want to go and get rid of is the um, Better Homes and Gardens Warm Spring Sunshine. It looks like this, and I have two left. I also want to use up the Better Homes and Garden Smoky Gray Mist. It looks like that, and I have two left. Um, another thing I definitely want to use is the Better Homes and Garden Limited Edition Sunset Island Sands. It looks like this, and I have two left. As you can tell, you guys, I love wax warmers. I'm just going to show you my collection afterwards. You know, why not? I'm already here near it, so. Um, I also have Sensational's Love Letter, Love Letters, and um, it's also limited edition, and it's in Cedarwood, Vanilla, and Almond. This is what it looks like, and this is three. Um, this one's okay. It's meh. And then I want to go and get rid of the Mainstay Tranquil Island uh, Wax Warmer Cubes. It looks like this, and I have two left and the reason why I really want to get rid of this I don't really like the mainstay brand of wax warmers I don't have too many of them but when you open it up if I can open it up the wax as you can see it's just very gunky and very weird and it feels oily and I'm gonna have to go and scrape it, everything out of there it's just very slick feeling and I don't I don't know none of the other wax warmers are like that so I definitely probably will never purchase from this brand again unless it's in candles. So there's that. And then I want to go and use up my Better Homes and Gardens Soft Cashmere Amber. It looks like that. And that's, I got one left. This, I mean, obviously that's probably going to be the next thing I'm going to use. And the last thing that I have that I want to use up is the Unstoppables Febreze Melts. And it looks like this. And I have four left. I actually, re I recorded this video and I was like, I don't like how it looked. I don't like how I looked in it. So I just kind of deleted it. And I did have five and now I have one. I mean, I used one. So that's where that came from. <sighs> Boy. So I think I might go and show you guys my collection because I have quite a bit left. So I'm going to go and get these out, and then I'll go and show you guys. So if you guys don't want to see the rest of my collection, you can go ahead and click out of this video, and I'll see you guys later in my next video. But if you want to stick around and see all the wax memories I got, I don't have too, too many. I mean, I think I just split everything down the middle. So if you guys want to see it, then continue watching. So I have a Mainstay Pine Wax Cube, and it looks like this. And I've got one left. I'm going to add this to my project pan just because it's the Mainstay brand. So any Mainstays I'm just going to add. And I also have the Mainstay Peaceful Waters, which looks like this. I have two left, and I'm going to add that one as well. And then I have my Oak and Rye Camelot scent. I really enjoy this. I have four left. Um, I'm actually going to go and add um, these. No, I'm going to add I'm going to add these lilacs, and I think I have another lilac one in the bathroom. This is by Tuscany Candle, and I have four left. I'm going to add this to my project, Melt That Candle, Melt, melt That Wax, because I have so many lavender ones, I mean lilac ones, it's kind of ridiculous. So I'm just going to add that there. And so I have the Better Homes and Gardens lilac one. I have the Better Homes and Gardens Fall into Autumn. Um, didn't I? No, I didn't. Um, I have the Amber Essence Gerberia Daisies and Daffodils. I have the Better Homes and Gardens Chris Fall Leaves. Oh, I didn't show you how many I had left. That I have that much. And that one's full. And the lilac one is full as well. And there's that and that one. I think, I don't remember what I showed you, so... I have the Sensational's Illusion, and it's the Cedar Musk and a Touch of Mystery. Looks like that. And I get all of these at Walmart, except 
um, this one I don't get at Walmart. I got that at Kroger's. Um, I have the gar Better Garden Home, Better Homes and Gardens Tranquil Spa. I have that much left. And I have Sensational Date Night Mixable Fragrance, and it's in the shade Moonlit Walk and Candlelit Kiss. I have that many left. You guys, if you are going to go on a date or you're going to have your boyfriend come over or whatnot, this is the perfect date night scent. Like, this is just date night scent. I highly enjoy it. Um, I also have a wonderful winter, a wonderful winter, Better Homes and Garden. I got two left. I'm just going to go and use this one. Eh. Might as well go and get rid of all my winter scents as much as I can. Most of them. Um, I have the Sensational Simple Romance. Um, it's a set uh, set the mood with a woodsy vanilla. It looks like that. I got one. I'm going to add this one too. I got, you know, I might as well. The more I get rid of, the more I can get more. I have the Sensational honey, Honeysuckle Nectar with Wild Mountain Honey. I've got that many left. And I got Fall in the Autumn, fresh one. I got another Fall in the Autumn, fresh one. <laughs> I got another Fall into Autumn fresh one, and then I have um, Autumn Hayride Sonama, and I, I got this one at Kohl's, actually, which smells amazing. This one is the perfect autumn scent, and I got that many left, I got four, and then I have the Island Pomelo Dragon Fruit, and it's Better Homes and Gardens limited edition, and I got four left. And then I have another Febreze one, which I'm just going to go and add to my project pan, project melt that wax, and I just got one left. This little guy, I kid you not, he's been, he's been ridiculous. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> Sorry, I keep looking at him. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you want to go and see my future updates and subscribe to my channel, and please give this video a thumbs up, and please give this video a thumbs up if you think he is cute. Huh? His name is Dorian Gray. Bye, guys.